I'd like to tell you about our activities at IHE Delft in relation to water cooperation and water diplomacy. We have three pillars. The first is education, the second is research, and the third is capacity building. In the first one, we have two master programs. The first is a specialization in water conflict management, which is taught entirely here in Delft. The second is a joint program on water cooperation and diplomacy, which we run jointly with the University for Peace in Costa Rica and with Oregon State University in the United States. The first program is 18 months long and the second is 17 months. Our second pillar relates to research. At IG Delft, we have many disciplines under the same roof, whether it's technical disciplines, scientific disciplines, or political ones related to governance. Our research brings together these different disciplines, and some of our colleagues are leading projects with a transboundary nature, whether they are projects that are looking at modeling uh, between two countries in a sub-basin where there is a transboundary uh, component, or whether, like, whether looking at wastewater treatment, so more thematic areas in international basins, we have the ability to bring all of these disciplines together and look at topics from a new and different perspective. The third area is capacity building. We appreciate that many who are working in water cooperation and diplomacy may not have the luxury of spending 17 or 18 months studying the topic, and so we offer courses for professionals. Shorter courses, uh, which uh, can be for a basin, stakeholders from an entire basin coming together to enhance their knowledge and skills and abilities um, to do transboundary water cooperation and diplomacy, or whether it is tailor-made trainings uh, for specific stakeholders with a specific interest in an area related either to water diplomacy or water cooperation.